my fantasy has finally come true. God must have smiled upon me the day I met you. Okay, today I'm so happy. I have had the best moment ever. I've enjoyed my wedding. Uh, I'm also grateful to God for helping us through all the plans. Uh, I thank all the people who supported us, specifically our families, our friends, our colleagues, and all who made it possible for us to see such a wonderful event. I'm very grateful to them. I'm also happy because at least now I'm Mrs. <laughs> I've gotten a new name. Hey, I'm grateful to have you. <laughs> so I'm just looking forward to having a great time with him as we nurture our own family, come up with our own principles. Just pray that we shall be a great Just the slightest touch sends me right to heaven. Mm, yeah, I forgot that it's supposed to feel like this. Inspire my desire and showed me what I missed. If I was ever frozen in time. We met in Western Outreach, the University of Nairobi. He was the chairperson of, uh, of that ETU. And I just came in as a first year. And he noticed me. So after my second year, he approached me. And that's how all this came up. <laughs> as life goes on, I pray I never take you for granted. Okay, I love this salvation, the leadership qualities, and so I knew if he can be my head, <laughs> he'll be a good leader of the family, and he's so friendly, he's so outgoing, hardworking, and many qualities that I can't mention. Right? If I was ever frozen in time. Wouldn't matter how when or why it would be As long as I knew that you were next to me Frozen in time for eternity If I was ever frozen in time 